A reading from the letter of Paul to the Romans. I myself am convinced about you, my brothers and sisters, that you yourselves are full of goodness, filled with all knowledge, and able to admonish one another. But I have written to you rather boldly in some respects to remind you, because of the grace given me by God to be a minister of Christ Jesus to the Gentiles in performing the priestly service of the gospel of God, so that the offering up of the Gentiles may be acceptable, sanctified by the Holy Spirit. In Christ Jesus, then, I have reason to boast in what pertains to God. For I will not dare to speak of anything except what Christ has accomplished through me to lead the Gentiles to obedience by word and deed, by the power of signs and wonders, by the power of the Spirit of God. So that from Jerusalem all the way around to Illyricum I have finished preaching the gospel of Christ. Thus I aspire to proclaim the gospel not where Christ has already been named, so that I do not build on another's foundation. But as it is written, those who have never been told of him shall see, and those who have never heard of him shall understand. This is the word of God. Thanks be to God. A reading from the Gospel according to Luke. Jesus said to his disciples, A rich man had a steward who was reported to him for squandering his property. He summoned him and said, what is this I hear about you? Prepare a full account of your stewardship. Because you can no longer be my steward. The steward said to himself, What shall I do? Now that my master is taking the position of steward away from me, I am not strong enough to dig and I am ashamed to beg. I know what I shall do so that, when I am removed from the stewardship, they may welcome me into their homes. He called in his master's debtors one by one. To the first he said, How much do you owe my master? He replied, One hundred measures of olive oil. He said to him, Here is your promissory note. Sit down and quickly write one for fifty. Then to another he said, And you, How much do you owe? He replied, 100 measures of wheat. He said to him, Here is your promissory note. Write one for eighty. And the master commanded that dishonest steward for acting prudently. For the children of this world are more prudent in dealing with their own generation than the children of light. The Gospel of the Lord. Praise to you, Lord Jesus Christ.